The home where they were cooking food, this is what has brought stagnation in your life. That home, they were cooking food. Give me no good. Cooking food, you can find that they cook, either they sell food, they don't like that, because I see the suspense, whatever they're cooking food. Oh, yes. What the man of God has says is really true. There was a place in Chingola where I was working, then in the mines. So there was a home where we used to go and eat from. At one time, the owner of that home, who was a lady, um, approached me that she wanted to borrow some money. So I gave her the money, and after some time, um, we kept on going there eating. Of course, she borrowed the money with an understanding that she would pay back at a certain date. Now, when that time to pay back came, I noted that she was now starting to advance in terms of seducing me. Um, then I realized that if this goes this way, then I won't be able to get my money. I insisted that I needed to get the money, though we kept on going there to eat, until finally she paid off the money, and uh, that's how I stopped eating from that place. But it never took long. Um, from that time, my job was retrenched. That's how I lost my job at, at KCM Mines. So I confirmed that indeed, the prophecy is true from the man of God that my okay. stagnation come, come. came at the router. My name is Andrew Nkata. Mm -hmm. uh, the person standing behind, besides me is my brother. Mm -hmm. But let me talk about a witch doctor who had a slight gap in the teeth. In the teeth. Yes. I want to confirm the prophecy that the man of God gave to us concerning a witch doctor who had a gap in between the tooth. I want to confirm that the prophecy is very true. When we were still young, and specifically in the year 1986, uh, my father got sick just after he was retrenched. And, af and after that, uh, my mother and my father sought to go and, uh, and inquire from the witch doctor. This is late. Yes, he had a gap, yes. So when they went there, there they were told that somebody did some witch, uh, some witch uh, magic on our father. So uh, they were given a certain kind of a stick and uh, there were some beads also that were there. So they were told to say, uh, upon arriving home, you put it on your head. Then you gather all your children and uh, uh, tell them to, to, to behave as though they are handling something in their hands. Then they look back whilst closing their eyes and throw it and cast it as they say that uh, thunder fall, fall away from us. So we declared all those words. So in the night of that day, whilst the stick that was given to our father was on their head, they came to tell us when we were old enough now that uh, the same stick that they had acquired produced light in the night. So I confirm that the prophet that the man of God said is very true. As he said that, uh, this is what has affected your lives. So the prophecy is very true. Ever since that time, uh, the life started to crumble, both with our parents and us as children. So the prophecy is very true. Doctor, go. Brother Andrew, being delivered 